This is something controversial. I'm calling out the entire makeup industry. These companies are telling you, yeah, it's gentle, it's safe. And then 10 years down the line, oh my God, I'm infertile. Oh my God, I have cancer. This cosmetics issue is even bigger than the tobacco industry because we're talking about thousands of different chemicals. The same chemicals being dumped and running through the rivers are running through our blood. Skin care, hair, feminine care products have been associated with reproductive problems. Ovarian cancer, preterm birth, mercury poisoning, endocrine disruption. The cosmetics industry comes back with their own science, and they say, oh, just a little bit of a cancer-causing chemical. You have no way of knowing what's in your product. Wealthy, big corporations don't allow regulations to happen who allow people to be harmed. One person versus a humongous pharmaceutical company. I hope that with this self-experiment that I'm doing, it'll catch people's attention. So you have higher levels than most Americans in at least three of your samples mm -hmm. here. Chemicals are not like people. They're not innocent until they're proven guilty. Unless we do bring these chemicals under better control, we are certainly headed for disaster. We don't want to wait 60 years to find out that some chemical we use in hand lotion is causing breast cancer.